There was a ginormous spider. Like I, like I'm, I'm not even kidding you. Like I'm, sh shat my pants actually. So I'm just telling you that has nothing to do with anything except that there was a spider. Um, also, I am wearing faxes. I am okay. Hello. It's um, it's photo shoot day. To be honest, I'm terrified to the to the to the. <laughs> to the end of Fergie, to the to the fact oh dear to the point where I am I don't I am I'm trying not to do it because I'm scared but I'm not gonna let myself do that because that's evil evil okay um so I got some supplies yesterday for the photo shoot I have a whole little thing in my head and I'm very excited because I feel like it's gonna be super cute and I know it's gonna be super cute I'm just really nervous so, but I wanted to show you what I got. So, let's do a little haul. I'm a little close here. Bite the fogo. Okay. So, my... Uh, I don't know why. I'm just nervous. Anyway, this whole collection or whatever, the first little bit, is obviously summer type vibes. And it is becoming fall soon. So, that's... It is what it is, but the importance of this to me is like the energy that I want to create going on picnics or gardening or eating healthy vegetables and fruits like planting and and growing your own food and just very natural and I have these strawberry earrings that I got from an antique store and they're just little like plastic strawberries they're very cute and I always get compliments on them when I wear them and it just makes me feel like I'm like strawberry shortcake and I love them I truly do and so I was like I feel like other people would love stuff like this because I love stuff like this and they just make me very happy and I feel very pretty and I feel like it gives me a sort of energy and then, you know, like, if anyone compliments it throughout today, that's like a conversation starter where I can talk to people. This past Christmas, uh, we did, like, a secret Santa at work, and I wanted to make something... Well, here's the thing. I love homemade presents. I love homemade gifts so much. And my idea for the secret Santa was to get earrings off of Etsy that were a charcuterie board. The earrings that I liked were from like Australia or something and I couldn't get them shipped in time. So I was like, well, I might as well try and then if it fails, I'll just get something else. I don't know. And I made these really cool charcuterie board earrings and they took quite a bit of time, but it was really fun and everyone loved them. And they were honestly, like they were so cute, but they were like the most hodgepodge shit. Like I used pottery clay and painted it with acrylic and then glued it with super glue and then like I forgot to do, do a, make a hole so I had to go back and then I used these like earring clasps that were that I had from a while ago in my like little jewelry collection making collection everyone loved them and I I just was like wow wait like this is I can like this is a skill I have I never knew I don't know it all just kind of came together after that just a lot of memories in life go into this collection and it makes me really happy and I would wear every single one of these earrings. Here's what I got, okay? I know that was a lot of talking for all that, but it's just, I don't know, it's just important for me to talk about what I want to talk about. So I have, I got some just, I don't know what you would call this, card stock, paper, whatever. I got a pink, a yellow, and a white for backgrounds and then I also got this little wood kind of frame thing for a background as well. For the picnic kind of theme I got this little box which I'm, I kind of feel like it could be like a little picnic basket. I also got this little tiny basket. It's very cute and tiny. <laughs> it's so tiny. And then I also got some grass. I <laughs> just like a a wool felt fabric thing and I love the color. It's very nice. So if I need some grass for the picnic scene, I got two little fabric 
squares so i got a yellow and a blue and then for the gardening thing i got this little wooden frame i don't really know what this is but i figured i can put some soil in there and then do some little garden like just like make it a little raised bed garden you know so i thought that was so cute and that's all i got i'm really excited i guess we're gonna get started i don't know <laughs> look how cute it is it's so cute and tidy a pizza pie it's so cute broccoli look at the broccoli in the biscuit <laughs> I am going to just cut a little square of the yellow and the blue that will fit in here nicely. cannot believe how good these are turning out like do you want to see you're gonna cry cuz I'm crying look at that are you kidding me right now are you kidding these are so good I do it is 1 30 and I have work at 4 although this is very fun I don't want to take all day so I'm gonna set like a I would say probably three minute timer maybe a five minute but I'm gonna see so, I'm really excited. It's not particularly going by fast at all. And I don't know why, but I now am like, I don't know if it's me, but all the pictures are like coming out blurry because I don't know if I'm shaking or what, but... And also, I tried to set a timer, but it did not help in any way. And it's taking me, like, at least 10 minutes to do each one. So, I'm trying not to be picky. But I, like, the shaking is just really... So, I'm going to use the tripod to see how that works. These hairs are so funny. I feel like I'm losing my marbles right now. Like, my marbles are being lost. I am using the tripod, and still, it's still shaky because of my hand for some reason. So, I plugged in my, my, like, thingy. My thingy that is, like, if you press the button, takes a photo. Because I just can't do this anymore. I'm having so stressed, okay? It's fully. Hopefully, that'll make it go by quicker. I feel like this is actually smarter. yesterday it just was taking so long but the pictures look pretty good I'm just nervous because they're kind of repetitive but I'm gonna continue because we have a long white tagar it's been a while look I'm wearing gray who am I um my mother gave this to me and it's very soft so I am wearing it <laughs> I hate gray anyway though um it's been, it has been a while, and I, uh, a lot of stuff has happened, but, but I am getting, getting back in the swing of things, and trying really hard to keep a focus on my dreams, and my life, and all that stuff, and trying to put more discipline in my life, what the fuck is going on here, um, and so that's what's that. And I'm finishing the photo shoot today. Hopefully it goes well. I'm going to do the the extra little bits that I wanted to. Like the creative parts. Like the picnic basket and the little um, garden bed. So that's my goal. I actually edited the other photos and they look really cute. Um, it's a good start. I'm definitely judging myself. <laughs> But it's a good start. Like, I need to start somewhere, you know what I mean? And it's already fall. Um, so I need to get this going because um, I need to start working on the fall collection. So, 
this is why I need to get things going. I'm giving myself an hour to do this. I'm trying to time myself so I don't get like get caught up in one activity today. So I'm I thought I was gonna have to go get soil, but I we, we have dirt at home. <laughs> um, and I just I should have recorded it because it's funny, but I was just digging up dirt with a spoon <laughs> in the front yard. And my next plan is to put. Oh wait, I forgot I was doing like a garden basket. I was about to make dinner, but wait, I think I forgot that you have to salt your aubergines before you can cook them. Anyway, though. Garden bedtime. <laughs> Check the mic and make sure it sound right, boys. 